Ohio is a collection of premium digital content for Ohio's teachers, students, and parents. Many of our resources are not freely available on the internet. Go to www.infohio.org. Always check to make sure you are logged in with either your school district username and password or as a statewide user. If the box in the top left corner is green, then you are logged in. If it is red, a login is required. To learn more about logging in, watch our video, Logging In to Access Digital Content from InfoHio. Scroll down on the home page until you find the iSearch search box. iSearch is InfoHio's discovery search interface. iSearch lets students explore multiple collections of magazines and journals, newspapers, reports, primary sources, encyclopedias, videos, and ebooks. Reliable content that isn't available on the web. From a single search box, making it easier for you to find the right content for research or for other projects. With iSearch, you can search most of InfoHio's reliable digital resources all at once. Think of iSearch as Google for InfoHio. Here I did a search for polar bears. If your school or district uses InfoHio's library services for their library catalog, you can access the print materials in your school library along with the ebooks and videos available from InfoHio in the My Library tab. For example, students from Anna Local Schools can find books about polar bears from their school library. If your school does not use InfoHio's library services platform for their library books, you can still access the ebooks and videos from InfoHio in the first tab. Here are the search results when you are logged in as a statewide user. You will notice it does not name a school or a district at the top, and the first tab is ebooks and videos. I have done a search for bears, and the results I have are all digital content, ebooks or videos that are all available from InfoHio. The ebooks include titles from BookFlix, World Book Early Learning, and the Gutenberg collection of classic titles from Open Access. Videos from the InfoHio Digital Video Collection are present in the first tab as well. In iSearch, we wanted to make it easier to find the right kind of content by separating different types of content into tabs. Here I have done a search for polar bears and I'm on the Encyclopedias tab. Here I get high quality encyclopedia articles from publishers like Worldbook. Let's take a look at the remaining tabs across the top. You will find magazines and newspaper articles, usually at a lower Lexile reading level, on the Basic Source tab. The resources on this tab are appropriate for learners K through 12. You will find digital content from recognizable magazines, including Cricut for young learners, Scholastic magazines for middle school learners, and popular magazines like Time for older learners. Has your teacher asked you to use peer-reviewed or scholarly journals for your project? Well, you can find scholarly research articles that are more advanced on the Advanced Sources tab. The digital content you can find on this tab is suitable for high school students, advanced courses, and College Credit Plus courses. You can find resources related to science, technology, engineering, arts, and math on the STEAM tab. The digital content found on this tab would best support science, math, and the visual arts classroom. You can find articles, government documents, and other resources that have good information and are freely available on some specialized websites on the Open Access tab. The digital content located here is suitable for high school students, advanced courses, and College Credit Plus. To access any of the individual results you find on the tabs, you will select the View and Download button. To learn more about viewing, downloading, and saving articles, and advanced searching and limiters in iSearch, 
Watch all the iSearch video tutorials.